What's poppin' Jimbos? Welcome back to the channel. We're here in L driveway with cars. This is a car. What car is this? Just a uh, car? And then we got another car over here. So welcome to our car channel. This is a new whip reveal. Fastest car we're gonna own, probably most horsepower. Just look at that 15 JZ. Anyway, what we're actually doing, we have some new headlights for this thing. But first, before we show you those, we're going to give her a wash. And before we give her a wash, since I got no headlights, I'm not going to be dealing with this anymore. All this peel. And then we're going to go ahead and peel this off. I've been wanting to do this for so long. Oh boy. Oh, look at that. I haven't seen these looking so long. Oh god. Yeah, we're really going to need to give her a wash. Ew, why is it like that? That's so bad. I hope this comes off. Yeah, it'll come off. Gross stuff. All right. So it looks. <laughs> cool. So we're actually gonna spray these a little bit, like one coat probably, with some tint shade. But let's get to washing. All right, washed wet. Why does that look so bad? Look how bad this is looking. Good thing these are about to come off. But she is rinsed and dried. We're gonna touch it up after with some detail spray. But right now we're gonna take the headlights out after we clean up and get to assembling them. Time to grab. When we took the tint off, there's a bunch of like residue. Obviously, it took most of it off, but he was using a blade, so there's some scuffs. We're gonna spray tint them, maybe like wet sand them or, or buff them, whatever people do with taillights, so that they're nice again. And here we have light bulbs. So I ended up buying new LEDs. You should. Going. <laughs> I mean, the OEM ones fit, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Is it fog lights on them? I was like, but they're not fog lights. He's like, this is LED light. And I'm like, okay, I guess that works. So this is how the headlights came. I was super confused. So, oops. There's a bunch of instructions. We're gonna do it here. I think you have to take this off, and then you hide it somewhere in there. The bulb goes there. It's so weird. So like I get this and I'm like, what's going on? Oh, this is where the bulb goes. First step obviously is to take this off. This, let's not lose any of these, is bolted to this right here. The instructions say that you have to stick that somewhere inside. It goes above. Go ahead and give that a shot. It said it goes up there. Is there like a way to bolt it up there? Okay. Does it just stick up there? So we just did that. I don't know if you saw that. It's like stuck up there. I guess that's how it works. What's next? The bulb? Let's find out. Plug the bulb the harness. harness into the wiring harness. So we don't have one, but I'm pretty sure this is going to work. I think we try to put this in first, maybe? Does this connect? And then this? connect that? Let's go to that. Yeah, yeah. So this is going to go... Plug the bulb adapter don't drop that. Yeah, we, we went no harness, so we're just sending it. These actually worked really well. Is that all five? We're done. Next headlight. Number two. You want to chop it up? You get your own Helix headlights. They come with your very own chopsticks. That's pretty gas. Snap. We'll do this one quick. We take this off. It goes up there. And then we just plug in the LED from there. We're installing headlights. No way. You learn a lot of things in Plain Cloud these days. Look at that. That's so weird that it just does it like that. And these are going to have to come this way. We have to make some space. We're working with some bulbs I got from O'Reilly's, but I think it works. Black to black. Red to green. And then, maybe that one. Bulb in. Cap on. Alrighty, she's all buttoned up. Both of them. God, it's going to look sick. Right, now you gotta pop this out of this clip. All that is next. This, 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 and then we can get to the mounting bolts like that one. Nice. Um, also, we're gonna take this off now just to deal with it later. So I think it's only two bolts. And oh, oh, in this one. Yeah. The only reason why you gotta take out the bumper. Bad. And then this bolt is a really important bolt. As you see, it holds all the force of the um, headlight. Don't forget to torque that to a thousand foot pounds. Should come out now. Or Damn! Hello, mate. All right, boys. Sheesh. This is supposed to come out. Uh, I don't have one in the other one. Oh. I have a feeling that's that'll do it. 
All right, let's put this thing in. So you want to line up that bolt and then that little thing. I just put it in slides right there. It's definitely better to plug it in before you install it. Imagine just doesn't fit. <laughs> Once you hear the click, you know you're good. It's gonna look so good with my paint. I'm so happy to do the red and chrome. And it has the hexes like when you look down on it too. All right, time for number two, and then we'll get back to you. All right, so we just assembled the second headlight. Here's both the old ones, and here's the new. Oh! Man, this shit gonna let me fall. What's that? Well, let's get the shit out of the scratch. So, gotta put in. All right, test number one. There are 500 for both. Oh, let's go. There you go. What about left and right blinkers? Oh. All right, so we decided just to test them before we put the bumper back on and uh, start assembling everything. Now that we know that all the features work, we can start putting back on the bumper and uh, see what it looks like. Turn off your hazards, brother. It looks like a Mark VI now. Okay. Okay. So hard. So they're finally installed, boys. Whip's looking nice, man. So we're gonna wipe them down. I'm gonna detail the car a little bit, but gonna get out of here. And that's been it. Maybe get you some shots. Bro, they look crazy. Thanks for watching, boys. Bye. We're back, boys. So, as you see, we installed everything, but little problem happened. Let me see if I can show you. If I put the key in. So, the headlights are on right now. So, as you see, that bulb looks to be working fine. But, this bulb. So, I think I know what I did. So, we're going to take it out right now. See if we can fix it. First, we're going to take this pesky plate off. I think this is the last time, boys. I think I'm running no plate after this. This thing, I don't know. just kind of sucks taking off every time. And I know it'll look better. I'm praying we can get this thing off because it's pretty messed up. Yeah, look at that. Oh my god. Please, Lord Jesus. Oh my god. It actually came off. So surprised. I was going to put this on, but it looks like it melted in my car. So, I don't know now. Pulled the bumper off just enough to reach that. Now I'm going to take this off real quick. Get the headlight out. We gotta redo this thing so these bolts are all gonna come out real quick. We got it fixed. So I just flipped it inside. I was a little worried because it's like, you know, a little loose, but I mean, well, now I just have like dynamic lights. Look. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> okay, hopefully screwing the top on real nice will help that. I mean, if it works, I'm, I'm not tripping. Let's put that back on real quick. She's back on. Fitment is way better now. Lights actually work, obviously. So we're gonna put the bumper on. on. Very nice, very nice, boys. Should I run no hole actually? It looks kind of sick. Turn the DRLs on. So those are the DRLs. Looking sick. Light bulbs, they're not both fixed. One, two. Perfect. And then these would be the high beams. Sheesh, you hear them? You can literally hear and they turn on. Yeah, that looks horrible. That's been it for the headlights. So thanks for watching. That's been the headlights for the Golf. Next, we might be adding some air to a part of the suspension. So check that out. Damn, am I even tinted? Wait for that. It's been a real one, right? All right, bye.